Jared from Scarlet Rhapsody here. We are at Kamikaze Expo 2012. It's been completely awesome. I am at the booth of one of the coolest comic companies I know, Aspen Comics, and I am here with Mr. Vince Hernandez. How's it going, guys? And girls. Yeah. Don't want to leave out the girls. Exactly. Yeah. Now, how have things been going for you here at Kamikaze? Well, this is our first show, our first year at the show, so for us it's kind of a it's a bit of an experiment. We're seeing how good we do. The lines and the people in the show, I mean, it's, the crowds are great. So for me, uh, you know, I just want to see how it does. We're not looking to make huge sales. We're not looking to make a, a huge announcement. We're just kind of here because it's our local show. Uh, we wanted to get a feel for, you know, just how well the show does. But it looks like a great crowd, and we're excited for a good Sunday. Now, I see some beautiful sketches right along here. Yeah. Um, Tell me a little bit about this. Well, this is actually original Michael Turner art. Uh, you know, our founder who passed away in 1998. We still sell his original art, and it's actually uh, one of our most valuable assets as a company. And basically, we like to put it out here. It is for sale. The prices, uh, you know, range anywhere from a huge amount to, uh, you know, something small, reasonably priced for fans. Uh, we like to display it off for people who are fans. Obviously, if you're a fan of Aspen Comics, you're most likely a fan of Michael Turner who founded us. Uh, so we'd like to, you know, respect that and have this art available for people who want to look through it, people who want to maybe purchase it. Uh, it's a once-in-a-lifetime purchase for anybody who's looking to get original art. I saw the uh, Supergirl one. Yeah, that's very beautiful. I've, I've always been a Supergirl fan. Yeah, my concern is Supergirl run, I think, was one of the most definitive runs of Supergirl, period. Uh, I think he basically brought her back after she passed away, or I don't know how they even killed her before. Uh, back back in the day, it, but it gets so convoluted. As yeah, I guess they all die some in some fashion at some point. But Michael brought her back. Michael Peter did that uh, Superman Batman run that really kind of highlighted her return, the return of Supergirl. And yeah, we we built the prints for DC back in the day. And they're still popular. People still love that Supergirl, the, the version that Michael did. So we always like to have a few prints that people can check out and see, and you know, just enjoy the art. Now. What has been the most popular book at, at Kamikaze thus far? Uh, you know, we have a few titles that are really popular right now. Obviously, Lady Mechanica is probably our red hot most one, popular title. One of our podcast members loves that book. Yeah, everybody loves that book. It, you know, we took a bit of a delay between three and four. We're kind of getting a few issues under our belt before we re-release it, but the back issues still sell great. Everybody still wants to, uh, you know, it's a big steampunk show. I can just tell from all the outfits and costumes I've seen walking around. So for us, uh, that book's been really well. Executive Assistant is always a popular title for us. Yeah. And of course, Fathom and Soulfire are our big money makers. You know, people love Michael's work. And uh, you know, for us, we, we, we put a lot of art into the Fathom and Soulfire story. So, uh, you know, all those books are doing really well. You know, each other book is doing well in its own right. That's good. We're excited. What's, what's your favorite? Oh, gosh. I mean, I, as editor-in-chief, I kind of have a special place in my heart for every book. Obviously, I think, you know, my book, I love my book, Karis Magic. Um, I also do Executive Assistant Assassin, so for me, the Executive Assistant title is kind of, you know, I, I really enjoy just editing those books, writing those books. Uh, you know, it's hard. I really can't put, you know, a, a, you know, a finger on one particular title that I like more than the others because all the creators are behind me, too. So. There, there is some great art in a lot of yeah. the books, and I really like that. I recently did a review for uh, Idolized, and I thought, I thought it was Yeah, very, again, very I mean, Idolized, job. yeah, another book I didn't even mention. I mean, we have a few titles right now, it's hard to keep track, but Idolize, you know, actually David Schwartz, the creator, just showed up, so, you know, we're excited to have the Idolize fans come by the booth and check out, you know, issue two, which will be out pretty soon, and do a few copies here for people to check out, so, yeah, that was our last, that's our first big superhero release, so, we're excited, we're, we're just going to see how that book does. So, any uh, last recommendations for our fans, something they should check out, something they don't know about? If you don't know, we're celebrating our 10-year anniversary coming up this year. Uh, if you're on Twitter, you can check the hashtag Aspen10, and that's basically the, the hashtag you're going to want to use to find out everything about Aspen and how we're going to be celebrating our 10-year anniversary. Sounds awesome. Good luck with all the books. Awesome. Good to be with you. Good to be with you, too. Good. Enjoy the rest of the show. Thank you.